adopting more than Article 16, please raise your card. I find that more than Article 16 carries. Or in Article 17, the Town Re Reevaluation Reserve Fund. Is there um, anyone who will move to open debate on Board Article 17? Mr. Irving and Ms. Salvati, and member of the Select Board, Ms. Stewart. Yes, thank you. All right, so this is the fourth year, fourth and final year, that we have asked the town for the $17,625 that does come out of taxation. That fund that it's going to, you'll see in the very next part of it, we're going to be using to fund the revaluation that we are required to do by the state every five years. So that is a process this year. This completes the final payment. We'll be withdrawing it in the next, hopefully, in the next one hour. It was recommended by both the board budget group. Thank you. Any debate on board article 17? Ready for a vote, folks? A uh, yes vote is to um, raise and appropriate that sum of 17625 to the Town Evaluation Reserve Fund. You're all ahead of me. Good. Um, please lower your cards. Those opposed to um, adopting Article 17, I find that more Article 17 is adopted. More than Article uh, 18, um, Town Evaluation. Will anybody move to uh, open debate? Uh, Ms. Holmes, Mr. Jansen, uh, member of the select board to present it, Ms. Hewitt. Yes, thank you. So now, this is the Warren article that allows us to spend the $70,500 that we just completed um, with the final, the prior Warren So we do have $70,500 in that account. We're asking for the authority to uh, withdraw so that we can pay for the rebound process, which costs $70,500. And it's recommended by both the board and the budget board. Great. Hi. We want to go. You're killing me. Okay. Those in favor of adopting. Wait, I, I have a question. There's a question. So we're in debate on more article 18. I'm sorry. Is this year the year that the reevaluation is occurring? Question to the moderator is this year the reevaluation is occurring? Yes, it is. And how were the citizens notified that we were being reevaluated uh, every so often? So, a question about the notification process. We you put something on the website in the fall, and we are having an information session on the entire layout process in, in April 12th. And so, because it's a Wednesday night, the town hall is for here at the town hall. Stay tuned. And how often does the reevaluation happen? How many X number of years? How often does it happen? We are required by state statute of the to be points every five years. All right. I think we are uh, ready for the vote on Warren Article 18. Those in favor, please raise your card. And those opposed, please lower your cards. Those opposed to the adoption of Warren Article 18, please raise your card. I find that Warren Article 18 is adopted. Warren Article 19 relates to land surveys and related expenses. Is there anyone who will move to open debate on Warren Article 19? Mr. Irving, Ms. Salvati, uh, Ms. Hewitt to present. Thank you. So this is a Warren Article that you see, we all see every year. What we are asking for is the authority to raise an appropriate $5,000, which we will use if somebody comes to us and they want to put land in conservation, we can explore that. We would use that $5,000 to help with surveys and the like. It is not coming from taxation. That amount of money, if we need it, would come from a... What, the Conservation Land Trust Capital Reserve Fund. So the one we just added some $10,000 to. So no impact on taxation. It's to cover some surveying and like expenses should they occur. Yes, vote is to uh, raise appropriate that sum. Those in favor, please raise your card. Please lower your cards. Those opposed to warn our, the adoption of Warren Article 19, I'm able to find by visual that it uh, is adopted by uh, this town meeting, so Warren Article 19 is adopted. The body has acted on Warren Article 20 and Warren Article 21. Will anyone move to open debate on Warren Article 22? Mr. Irving, Ms. Leopold, member of the select board to present. Thank you. Mr. Rowe. Thank you, Mr. Moderator. Uh, Article 22 comes to us um, 
there are a couple of different avenues and efforts on, on, in town. Um, a lovely, lovely resident who um, volunteered, uh, and I hope you all can see the display of those up, but we have an ample opportunity to go in and out in the hallway today, um, to, um, to all, not alter down the chain, but to, to, to modify our town seal, or town emblem rather, in a way that it could actually be visible and usable uh, on printed documents. Uh, she did not change the um, what is on those em on that emblem, uh, but it got to the point when we were trying to put it on the document, it was so blurry that it, you couldn't even see. So we thanked her for that, and then she joined the historical committee because you know she had worked with the historical committee. We were very grateful for her for her efforts, and it was suggested by um, by some folks on the historical committee and, and, and others in town that. You know, Rollinsford may have officially uh, incorporated in 1849, but we've been here a heck of a lot longer than that. And so, in 1967, the, the town, the town meeting, um, adopted as its town emblem, as part of a flag, what you see if you have your town reports in front of you. What you see there, very lovely. It's stitched, um, and it has the old mill, the Boundary, the Town Hall, the Wardway Homestead, which is um, down on Slido Road. Um, we are not suggesting, the historical committee was not suggesting changing that in any way. We think that the town emblem is magnificent, but they are suggesting that we had um, a stem, a settled rather, in 1623, incorporated in 1849 as a uh, as a salute to our, uh, to our proud past and heritage. And uh, it is recommended by the Board of Selectmen, of the Select Board, and I know it has been endorsed by the Historical Committee, and we would, we would appreciate your support. And if you haven't had a chance to see the magnificent poster that's up there, please take a look at the Historical Committee's table. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Roller. We're on order 22 to revise the town envelope. Okay. Uh, it sounds like we're ready for a vote. Those in favor of adopting the changes to the envelope, raise your cards, please. And please lower your cards. Those opposed to adopting the change in the uh, emblem, I see um, I'm able to declare it on a visual. Um, uh, it's not unanimous, but I'm able to declare it on a visual that um, the body has adopted the modifications to the emblem. Article 23 relates to authority to sell surplus equipment and vehicles. Uh, will anyone open the debate on Article 23, Mr. Irving and um, um, Mr. Dio? And members of the select board to introduce. Uh, this is another one we see up here. Um, authorized to sell surplus equipment and vehicles. Um, this is for when we put things out to bid, um, such as um, police cars. Um, the old fire truck was in the old town shed and put up the bed. I showed you before. Um, this just authorizes us to do that. Any questions? The fire truck that we are voting to replace today cannot go out for bid due to the provisions of the funds we are receiving. Is that correct? Correct. Okay. Any further debate on Article 23? None of you are ready for a vote. Um, a yes vote is to give the board the authority, and it looks like everyone's ready to vote. Those in favor, raise your cards. And please lower your cards. Those opposed to granting the board this authority, please raise your card. And I find that the motion carries. Uh, article 20, or, sorry, I find the article carries and is adopted by this um, meeting. Article 24, um, to transact any other business, there are two other um, pieces of business that I wanted to um, uh, mention. Uh, the first was to um, hold a moment of silence for Carlton Spencer. Thank you. Um, and uh, you may be seated, please. I ask that, um, those remaining in the hall who are newly elected or newly re-elected uh, to uh, positions as town officials, please come forward and Judge Roberts will administer the oath of office. Oh, are you awake? Yeah, actually, um, if 
I was given, I was, there was a request from the school uh, board that I read the results of the school board election. And Kate, do you have those results? Oh, yeah, that's right. You're my good side. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm the only one. Yeah. Okay. I apologize. All right. It's you and Charlie. Yeah. Uh, Tasha, is yeah. Tasha Lee? I think yeah. Tasha's gone. Okay. Yeah, we'll ask those who are not present to. Um, got Kate.